Have you ever wondered what could be so powerful that not even light can escape its grasp? Picture a force so immense, a pull so irresistible that nothing in its path can resist. This is the enigmatic world of black holes, celestial entities of such profound mystery that they've captivated our collective curiosity for centuries. These cosmic behemoths trap everything, light included, within their powerful gravitational clutches. Today we unravel the cosmic buffet of black holes, the accretion disks. Now imagine a flat rotating disk of matter spiraling into a black hole. That's an accretion disk for you. Let's dive deeper into understanding this cosmic phenomenon. An accretion disk, in its simplest form, is a structure often found around massive celestial bodies like black holes. Picture a whirlpool or a spinning top, and you've got a basic visual representation of this incredible cosmic feature. But why do they form around black holes? Well, when a black hole pulls in nearby matter, this matter doesn't fall directly into the black hole. Instead, it swirls around it much like water draining in a bathtub creating this flat rotating disk. This is due to a concept known as angular momentum. Now, angular momentum might sound like a fancy term but it's actually a principle we're all familiar with. Ever spun a top or rode a merry-go-round? Then you've seen angular momentum in action. It's the reason why an ice skater spins faster when they pull their arms in and slower when they extend them out. In the context of our accretion disk, angular momentum is what keeps the matter from falling directly into the black hole and instead causes it to spiral around it. The structure of these disks is fascinating. They're incredibly hot, flat and dense in the middle with cooler, less dense edges. This is due to the intense gravitational pull of the black hole, causing the matter in the disk to heat up and emit light, making them observable to us. But here's the kicker. These accretion disks aren't just theoretical constructs. They're very real and have been observed in our universe. Scientists have spotted these luminous disks around black holes, shedding light on the enigmatic nature of these cosmic giants. These disks don't just exist in theory, we've observed them in our universe. So, the next time you gaze up at the night sky, remember the cosmic whirlpools spinning around distant black holes and marvel at the wonders of our universe. Why should we care about these cosmic phenomena, you might ask? Well, accretion disks hold a key role in the intriguing world of astrophysics. They're like the all-you-can-eat buffet for black holes, serving up a tantalizing array of cosmic matter. Accretion disks are essentially flat, rotating structures of dust, gas, and plasma. They're spread around objects like black holes, providing them with their daily dose of cosmic nourishment. As the matter in the disk spirals closer and closer to the black hole, it speeds up and heats up, eventually getting eaten by the black hole. This process results in the growth of the black hole, which is why we often refer to accretion disks as the feeding grounds of these celestial titans. But, their role is not just limited to feeding black holes. Accretion disks also play a significant part in the creation of astrophysical jets. These are narrow beams of matter that are ejected from some black holes at nearly the speed of light. The matter in the accretion disk, as it spirals towards the black hole, gets twisted and churned, creating a magnetic field. This magnetic field is so strong that it propels some of the matter out in two opposite directions, forming these jets. And then we have quasars, the brightest objects in our universe, which wouldn't exist without accretion disks. Quasars are essentially supermassive black holes that are feeding on material from accretion disks. As this material spirals into the black hole, it heats up and emits an enormous amount of energy, creating a quasar. So, accretion disks are not just celestial plate spinners, they're the cosmic chefs cooking up some of the most fascinating phenomena in the universe. They're the driving force behind the growth of black holes, the formation of astrophysical jets, and the creation of quasars. In the grand scheme of the cosmos, we're just beginning to understand the crucial role they play. But one thing's for sure. Accretion disks are the cosmic diners where black holes feast. And trust me, they're serving up a menu that's out of this world. How do we know all this if we cannot even see a black hole, you might ask? Well, it's a bit like playing detective. We can't directly see what's happening inside a black hole, but we can observe the effects it has on its surroundings. This is where accretion disks step into the spotlight. Scientists study accretion disks, the spiraling buffet of matter surrounding black holes through indirect observations. It's akin to noticing the ripples on a pond to infer the presence of a stone beneath the surface. The matter within these disks spirals inward, heating up and emitting light as it does so. 
This light, though it doesn't escape the black hole, can be detected from the disk before it crosses the event horizon, that point of no return. Gravitational lensing is another tool in our cosmic detective kit. This phenomenon occurs when the gravity of a massive object, like a black hole, bends the path of light around it. It's as if the black hole is wearing a pair of glasses. By observing these light distortions, we can glean information about the black hole, and by extension, the accretion disk. But the investigation doesn't stop there. We also employ different wavelengths of light to probe these cosmic phenomena. Observations in X-ray, ultraviolet or infrared light can reveal different aspects of the accretion disk. For instance, X-ray observations can provide insights into the high-energy processes near the black hole, while infrared observations can tell us about the cooler, outer regions of the disk. Each of these methods is like a different lens through which we view the accretion disk, each one providing a piece of the puzzle. And when we put these pieces together, we get a comprehensive picture of these fascinating cosmic structures. So while we can't directly see a black hole or its accretion disk, we use these indirect methods to learn about their properties, their behavior, and their impact on the cosmos. Decoding light from accretion disks is like reading the menu of a black hole's feast. What's left to discover in these swirling cosmic phenomena, you may ask? Well, as it turns out, quite a lot. Accretion disks, these colossal cosmic buffets, continue to baffle and intrigue scientists worldwide. Despite the remarkable advancements in space technology and our understanding of black holes, there are still many mysteries surrounding these celestial phenomena that remain unsolved. One such enigma is the variability of accretion disks. Why do some disks appear to flicker, changing their brightness in a matter of hours or days? The answer to this riddle could potentially unlock new insights into the turbulent nature of these cosmic entities. Another area of ongoing research is the study of magnetic fields within accretion disks. Scientists believe these fields play a crucial role in the disk's structure and the way matter behaves within it. However, the specifics of this role are not yet fully understood. But it's not just about the mysteries. The study of accretion disks has also led to some groundbreaking discoveries. Take, for instance, the first ever image of a black hole's accretion disk. In the year 2019, the Event Horizon Telescope Collaboration released a stunning image of the supermassive black hole at the center of the galaxy M87. The bright ring seen in the image is the accretion disk, heated to billions of degrees as it spirals into the black hole. This image, the first of its kind, marked a significant milestone in our exploration of these celestial phenomena, and this is just the beginning. As we refine our tools and techniques, we can expect even more revelations about accretion disks. Who knows, we might even find some answers to the enduring questions about the universe itself. So, the next time you look up at the night sky, remember that there's a cosmic buffet out there, filled with mysteries waiting to be solved and discoveries waiting to be made. As we reach further into the cosmos, who knows what secrets accretion disks will reveal next. So, we've journeyed around black holes and through their cosmic buffets, we've plunged into the mystery of these cosmic giants and explored their celestial kitchens, the accretion disks, we've dissected their roles, observed their behavioral patterns, and even reveled in the mysteries and discoveries that these astronomical phenomena hold. In our journey, we've come to understand that accretion disks aren't just cosmic spectacles, they're key to unlocking the secrets that black holes hold within their dark, invisible confines. They're the breadcrumbs that lead us to understand the complex mechanisms at play in our universe. Their importance cannot be overstated. They are the cosmic laboratories that allow us to study matter under extreme conditions. They act as the celestial thermometers and clocks, helping us to measure the universe's pulse and temperature. But our exploration doesn't end here. There are still many unanswered questions and undiscovered truths. We're just at the edge of this cosmic frontier, and there is so much more to explore and understand. The universe, with its black holes and accretion disks, continues to beckon us, to challenge us, and to enthrall us with its mysteries. And we, as curious beings, will continue to seek, to learn, and to marvel. Before you go, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more deep dives into the mysteries of our universe.